What's up everybody, welcome back to Toothless from How to Train Your Dragons, Patreon request from Christina on behalf of her son. So, landscape page, pencil racer, hip pause, we'll go to fast. Requested a full body, so it's kind of more complicated, maybe, than what we're used to. So, we'll give it our best shot though. And let's go. Center point of my page here, his head is up top half, right? So center point, we go up and across. I'm gonna start with his eyes. So, curving. Like so. Kind of like teardrop sort of eyes. Goes around and then into a spike there. So he's got like a little line that sort of comes off here as well. And then at the front his nose so it's like this is like all part of his head and he's like a little sort of it's like an eyelid going around there and then he has square pupils they're kind of like long and square and you'll just color in black but we'll leave a little white section here Okay, similar situation over the other side. So, got his eye curve line. So, I'll just go curving up and around here. And then it kind of goes around like so. Boop. Bit bumpy there. And then goes to a point. And then top eyelid line. And it's like his, it's kind of like his eyebrow as well, you know goes down for his nose and then he has a little sort of bumpy scaly line around his eye and then his cool square eyes square pupils and we have a black highlight like a white highlight sorry I'm surrounded by black So his nostrils then. Just there. And then he's got that big long flat mouth. And it kind of just below his nose it dipped down a bit. Back up. And comes down to another little bump here on the side of his head. And it's like he's kind of smiling in the corner. Then his chin, so he's just coming down from here, just a round sort of small bottom lip, chin and jaw. Very thin bottom half of his face, right? And this will kind of keep going, right? So it'll go up to here. There's a bit of a gap and then it goes up again. And he's got all these horns and stuff on his head, right? So say on this side as well, I can see this sort of broken kind of line around there so coming out from the side of his head so on say on this side right we've got like a little fin or a horn or something here and then another one there and there's a big ear Coming up and around here. And then we go over here. So his head is kind of turned, so these are a little bit smaller on this side. And then his other ear kind of doesn't stick up as high on this side. You could do them the same height if you wanted, of course. And then he's got two little horns like right in the middle of his head. They seem to stick up pretty much close to the middle anyway. There. And then you have like the top of his head sort of line here. And then there's a line of spikes that go right up the middle of his forehead. They kind of start sort of in line with his eyebrows here. You just have these little spikes. Mm 
I mean, they kind of like disappear into his head. Right, and to make them look like a little bit sort of scaly, you could do like clusters of scales around his head here. Because he has like little clusters of these on his face every now and then. his ears and everything. Kind of like that. You can do as much of that as you want. He has them all over his head, really. But I think that's enough. It just gives a suggestion that he has scales and textures and stuff on him. So, his neck is kind of wide, but it comes down, say, from like the edge of his mouth. He's got a real wide neck. down in towards his belly and then the neck on the back comes right out from this sort of ear section seems to join his shoulder but we'll just go like there and he he has like neck muscles so you just do like little light lines like that just for his neck and maybe there's like some textures that come across here so he's got a big wing four legs so let's see the wing first right so it comes out from his shoulder here so he has like a shoulder section and the wing is like here and then his body kind of like curves down around that way some kind of particular kind of shape so our wing then goes this way, right? And then curves around. And then down. So we got this kind of essing sort of shape here. And the bone, so this is like a big bone, right? That connects his sort of skin together, I guess is the only way of describing it. So it starts to go down this way then. So that's like a big bone. And I think there's like a fin or something in here, there's like a fold. And then there's like a bit of a fin, like a piece of skin or webbing or something that like keeps his like wing all attached and stuff. And then I think we can see his back here. He's got some spikes that go down his back, I think. Now it's in this big wing, right? So it's attached to his body inside here, right? But it goes, this is like his leg as well. And is, is it attached to his tail? Maybe it is. So it comes out here and we got these sort of spikes then on the bottom, is that right? Are his wings like all attached? I don't know. So this goes. And then back up. Right. And then we got this edge line that goes the whole way down there. And then the wings have these like bones that run through it, go down to each spike, right? So you, it's all attached sort of down to there. Down to each section. Like that. Okay, getting there now. So he's got like a big leg that comes out the front and this is like his back and his belly, right? So like his belly sort of here. And then he's got a, like a shoulder line. 
and then his leg kind of just like comes out here. And his legs get real wide at the, at the top, kind of round at the top, like his, his feet sort of stick out that way. And then his back leg here comes out, joined, comes out from his body. I assume it's like joined to his belly somewhere there. But you got like a big tail that runs down his belly as well. And so that's like his foot. Leg, leg. And then we'll go for his belly, just like under here as well. And then the tail goes down that way. But we'll just get the other sort of shoulder sort of area here. And then his leg going down that way. So then the other leg curves out here. And then his other leg in the, at the back, like beside this one. We can just see sort of the back of it there. Now, see, so you can't see his belly here because he's got like a big part of his tail that like wraps around and goes out that way. So we'll add like toes first. Here, toenails. It's a one, two, three. He seems to have four. And then we got like some skin connecting it. So then spike. there one, two. and then his foot seems to go in there right so we can see all the toes in that one you can just see two does he have the spikes on the back of his leg there or is that oh no i think there are spikes on the back of his leg actually and then he's got like a spiky toe here goes that way and then another toe there skin just joining the feet together and he's got like little wrinkles around each toe there and that one as well one two three four legs yep and then he's got like scales like you know sort of these sort of clusters of scales on his feet He's got like uh, little wrinkles that sort of come over his toe there and then just some little circles joined together just to show that he's like a little bit scaly there on his legs okay so his tail then comes under here and wraps back that way and that has like wings coming off it as well so we'll go there right so it's like it's kind of attached to his belly and it's all part of the one thing and then it goes back around under this way and then that way and then comes out here somewhere right so his tail curves out like this and then we have the black part 
right? And then the bit that like, you know, like that's red, that's attached. So that goes that way, okay? And then the red part comes out here. And it seems there's like these little circles on the top on this one. And then we have little lines that go that way. And some on his black part as well, like skin lines. And there's like his head sort of drawn in here. It's like cartoony sort of toothless head don't put a lot of detail into it or anything it's just like eyes and then a little small mouth there right and then he's got um fins that run down his tail and then the back of the tail sort of goes that way <clears throat> going in there right and then he has spikes there as well and then another wing that's part of his tail so it goes sorry now if you can hear noise my wife is vacuuming the hall so this goes down that way, and then this curves around that way, like so. And then he has like a little sort of bony section on the edge, and some lines there. So we can just see like his shoulder wing-ish kind of area over here. So it just goes, it's like attached. So it looks like it goes like wide here. Up, around, and then like back around his shoulder again. Like in there little skin lines or something there and like the back of the wing there and that's it toothless hope it's helpful thanks for the request on patreon christina see you in the next one bye